What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about some of the new crafted sets that will be coming with the Fire Song DLC. Now over the last couple uh, DLCs, or over at least the last year, it seems like some of the crafted sets that will be in the new zones turn out to be some really good, you know, kind of sets to use early on in the game. And then there's some players that are even using them later on in the game. They're even comparing them to some things you can get from, you know, some harder in-game content. But with the Fire Song DLC, we do know there's going to be a couple new crafted sets. I'm going to go ahead and talk about those. First of all, you have Chimera's Rebuke, which is um, a set that's going to add for two items, 1,096 maximum magic. Three items is going to add 12,006 maximum health. And four items is going to add 1,096 maximum stamina. The five item bonus, gaining resources from a fully charged heavy attack, also restores 2,363 of the gained resource to the three allies nearest your target, which does sound kind of interesting. There might be some people out there that can find something to use that with. Kind of an interesting set considering you're getting magic health and stam from it. So it's not just one, you know, one thing or the other. And then that, uh, you know, gaining that, gaining those resources and restoring that to, you know, the three, ally, three allies nearest your target is a pretty unique thing too. Also, we had old growth brewer set, which is going to be, uh, 129 stam recovery, three pieces is going to be 129 magic recovery, and four pieces is going to be 129 health recovery. And the five piece bonus after drinking a potion, gain 245 magic, stamina, and health recovery for 45 seconds. There also could be some uses for this. I think some players maybe that play PvP would not be interested in this considering you get some recovery back. I don't know if it exactly would be something that PvP players are looking for, but it does. I think, or at least it will have some usefulness for some players. And last but not least, the Claw of the Forest Wraith, which is a set that's going to add 657 crit chance for the two-piece bonus, 129 weapon and spell damage for the three-piece bonus. The four-item uh, bonus is going to add 657 crit chance, and the five-piece item bonus is going to add 2,037 crit chance to your class abilities. Now, this one... I think some players in PvE may find a use for because a lot of people out there are always looking for things that are going to add a critical chance, critical damage, weapon and spell damage. And you get a good bit from this. Is it as good as some of the others we already have available? That's going to be something that, you know, personally for me, I'd have to wait and see until the update, uh, you know, comes out on here on PS5. But I'm kind of curious to see if you are on PC, if you're playing the, in the public test server, if you have tested this one out yet. Because it does seem like it could definitely have a use with that crit chance weapon and spell damage and then that large crit chance to your class abilities. Anyway, guys, those are the three crafted sets that will be coming with the Fire Song DLC in Update 36. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you had not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.